Chemical Reactions Unit, Lesson 1.5, Investigating Atoms and Properties. Activity 2, Playing Everything is Made of Atoms. Model, an object, diagram, or computer program that helps us understand something by making it simpler or easier to see. Scientists often want to learn about things that are too small to see. For example, we have worked with models to learn about small things, such as proteins and molecules. Scientists also use models to show things that are too large to see at once, such as ocean currents, earth plates, or the solar system. These models show things at a different size or scale so that they can be more easily investigated. We can't really see atoms because they are too small, but an atomic scale model, such as the diagram models we saw in the warm-up, can show the atoms that make up a substance. Key concept. Scale. Things that are too small or too large to see can be studied with models. Students, launch the chemical reaction simulation. Throughout this unit, we will be using a simulation called the chemical reaction simulation. We will use this simulation to help us learn more about the atoms that make up various substances. The simulation is a scientific model. Although this model is different from real life, it is accurate in many ways. Select the chemical stockroom mode via the global navigation menu on the top left corner of the screen. You can select up to three substances to compare. If you would like to see more substances, you will need to close some of the substances by pressing the X in the upper right corner of the substance window. We know that different substances have different properties. To learn more about why this is the case, we are going to use the chemical stockroom mode of the sim to investigate different samples at two scales the macro scale that is visible to us, and the much smaller atomic scale. This will help us learn more about atoms and what they tell us about substances and their properties. The diagram on your screen shows atomic scale models of three different samples. Working with your partner, you will first observe and discuss these models in order to make a claim about whether they represent the same or different substances. You will then use the chemical stockroom mode of the sim to obtain more evidence about these substances. Students, answer the questions on your student's screen. End of activity.